Alright, yeah, welcome back to RimWorld Alpha 13, this is Super Lad Man. If you're looking at the screen and wondering what the hell happened, well, in the last episode we got attacked by a hive of these little insects, so mega spiders and mega scarabs, and they decided to place their nest right here. And, yeah, we took a lot of injuries, and we did get a new prisoner, though, Anna, over here who uh, sustained many injuries on her way back into the colony. So, without further ado, let's continue where we left off. And hopefully... Hmm... Tending to Fisher. Yeah, good idea. Fisher also got an infection in her torso, because she spent most of the episode um, on the floor bleeding out. So, I'm kind of glad that Merritt's going in there now. Merritt's got some problems. And a couple of... Everybody's bleeding at the moment, which is a problem. And Fisher and Anna are starving to death. Can I not... You're incapacitated. Interesting. Yeah, we're not in a good situation right now. We have a prisoner, but no warden. Ah, incapacitated, that's fine. That should solve itself momentarily. Right, what's your health situation? You need to treat Anna. The more people treated quicker, the better. Let's get it done. And I know you're not the best doctors, but you'll have to do, because we have nobody better. So for the past couple of episodes we've been wanting to clean, and for the past couple of episodes it's been getting progressively worse. Uh, Anna has got an infection in her right arm. Wunderbar. Merit's eating the insect jelly that we unlocked. Do you get a bonus for that? I don't know. Apparently it is tasty stuff, this insect jelly. Jelly stored and used as food by oversized insects. It is smooth, rich and immensely satisfying. Because of this unique biological properties, it can nourish almost any creature and never rots. Oh, I thought it'd be like sweet sugar. Apparently not. Are you healed? You're healed. You're still bleeding out. Fisher, can you? No. Right, you can though. Treat each other. Treat each other nicely. <laughs> I really want to tidy this place up because it's a right crap tip. But. At this stage in time, it is not a priority, so I'm going to leave it well alone. To some of you, if you've been watching, may have been saying, stop trying to clean. Oh my god, Reich's got an infection now. So that's what get happens if you don't stop bleeding and all that jazz. So now Merit is going to treat Reich. Fortunately, we have a lot of medicine, so we're not in much of a problem that w in that regard. Best get Anna treatment before she starts getting injured as well. Lots of infections. Mad animal. A local boomalop has gone mad and it will attack everyone it sees. Ah, let's toggle that power. How close are you to? Let's treat that. Yeah, there we go. Merit, quickly run and turn that switch on. Quick, 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 quick. Faster. And yeah, sweet. Right. Um, who was the last person to be healed? I think that's it, other than our prisoner over here. So let's treat our prisoner. Treat her nicely. If she joins us, then she's a perfect doctor. And we've also got starvation setting in as well, so Merit's going to have to deal with that. Just gonna set everyone as a four for wardening. Did I not set you to get medicine? You deserve medicine. Yeah, I need to treat you guys. Treat you guys well. There you go. Fisher is fine and feed Anna now. And starvation has gone and everybody's back in a good mood. Which is 
looks like bed rest for the rest of us at the moment. Need to figure out some sort of way of farming those insects. The problem is that they mine, so you can't build, like, caves for them to stay in. Nor can you dictate where... Oh, Fisher needs some sexual healing. Yeah, you can't dictate where their insect hive's going to pop out. Case in point, in the middle of our bedroom wasn't a great place. But what can you do? So... Oh god, Major. I'm not sure if Fisher's going to survive this, in all honesty. No, Anna. Please, please treat her. In fact, Reich and Merritt are going to be number one doctors for the time being. Just relaxing socially while she starves to death on the floor. That's not very like you, right? There we go. Yeah, we're in a very precarious situation right now. I'm not sure how long I'm going to live on this run. But we've been getting tragedy after tragedy for quite some time now. Other than the fact that you're dying... What's your problem? Hungry, in a pain, in a hideous environment, yeah. I mean, not much I can do about that. Major infection, you're only at 38%. Can I say rest until healed? Yes, there we go. Reich needs treatment. Merit, treat Reich. Oh, off he goes. Needs treatment, but he's not going to go get treated. Rest until healed. Says he's not injured, but he's infected. Ah. That'll be why. I am looking at the wrong setting. Silly me. Right, prisoner. Let's chat and recruit this prisoner. She doesn't look. She's only 36 on the prisoner difficulty recruitment. So, I have high hopes that I'll be able to recruit her soon, and hopefully, because we're in a horrible situation right now. Mental state. Fisher has gone berserk. She's going to go beat up Anna by the looks of it, and she's passed out. Well, that solves that problem. Um, yeah, she's got an extreme infection now. You'll be already being rescued. Yeah. 77%. It's not like I can even chop the limb off. Major infection at 60. Major at 62. You're fine. Ugh. Come on, guys. Get better soon. We're in a bit of a limbo situation right now where not much is going on. And not much work's been done either. Fisher has died because of the infection. Rip. Let's get her a grave. Uh, Fisher's died from her infection. Ooh. Merit. Treat Anna. Oh, we're at 72 for Major. And 72 for Major, but he's just given her food poisoning by feeding her crap. Good to know. So it looks like we've lost Fisher, but we probably can keep our other two around. Maybe not Anna. Anna might be going pretty soon. Ah, dear. Good night, princess. Dead for less than a day. 
You are always such a pain in the ass, Fisher. Oh my god, this might be the end. A group of pirates have arrived in drop pods nearby. They'll prepare. The melee guys, alright. My turrets are still on, aren't they? Yes. Yes, they are. Well, we only have one conscious member of our team. Oh, and the power's going out. Oh, no. Why? Alright, let's toggle the lights off. I'm gonna get Merritt up so he can do it. Hopefully he does it. Tending. I'll allow you to tend. Need you to turn the lights off though. Feed and flicks. Yeah. We need to preserve the power so that our turrets stay online for that attack. Which we will now get Reich and Merit to go defend against. I don't think Anna's going to be... Oh, she's going to survive, hopefully. But she's in no condition to actually help us. Here we come. He's got a bloody sword! Come on, get the shield down. Well, that's one turret down. Uh-oh. Uh, plan of action. Run. <laughs> Seems like a good enough plan to me. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes. Right. Flee. Sally's gonna die. She's actually down. And so is Meritrix. Uh, you're horrible. And you're even worse. And only bruises. Okay. I mean, can we really afford to take on more people? We've already got one prisoner and I don't really want crap people, so... Melee attack her to death. Melee attack her to death. We're not really in the situation to take more recruits. We need to make sure that we can sustain the ones that we've got now. So, once you're done murdering them to death. Come on. That's it. Murder to death. You'll kill you to death, Rock. Instead of visiting the grave, can you uh, work on building the other grave for your friend? I'd appreciate that. No, no, not relax socially. Build the grave, please. Thank you. Thank you. Come again. Right. Anna. How's it going? Health. Anna's going to be fine. Yay! And the other Anna is starving to death. Does anyone want to go feed the other Anna? Mental state days. Reich, when we needed you most, has broken down and is wandering in a daze. Ah, I love this game. Nip hates me. It's an abusive relationship we've got here. I give it nothing but attention. And it gives me nothing but misery and misfortune. Go chat with Anna. Come on, Merit. I shouldn't have built this. This is annoying. But we did plan on making a line of not debris. So that never got done. Otherwise, it wouldn't be so much of an issue. Come on, Anna. Beat the odds. Join us. Survey says, Oh, come join the colony. It's really good and successful and not covered in blood at all. We could really use your help because we're dying inside. Please, Anna. Please join us. I mean, join us if you fancy it. Ah, uh, she's in a bad mood. 
Oh. 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 <laughs> wow. Murderized. Well, Anna apparently is suspicious that our colony is not all we're cracking it up to be. And in fact, the man who's walking around in a mental daze, naked. And Anna, who's just got a pair of pants on, who just sits there and does bugger all. Yeah, I can see. I can see why you'd think that we're uh, a terrible colony that's probably going to die in the next raid. I'm surprised we survived the raid that we did then, actually. Let's... Oh no, we turned the power off. Not that it matters. We have no turrets. Uh, we have no components either. That's a problem. So I don't see... There's a ship part there. Go deconstruct that when you get a chance. We need at least one turret set up. I believe you can make components, but I think it's a really late game research thing. You have to research. Yeah, yeah, I need a research bench. I'm aware of that. Um, component assembly. Yeah, so we need a high-tech research bench and the multi-analyzer. Might as well get the research bench in now. Got no better to do. I'm not sure if the con will last that long anyway. We can start turning all the lights back on. Ah, oh, 27% chance to recruit her though. Not bad. It's just a shame we couldn't get it done. Turn the lights on so you can see how ugly our colony is. <laughs> oh dear. Has anyone buried Fisher yet? No one's buried Fisher yet. Right. Strip Fisher naked. If you would be so kindly. You're not a hauler. That's highly unfortunate. Go bury Fisher, please, Anna. Thank you. How's Merritt doing? He's got some bruises. I'm not going to give him medicine for that. I don't need it. Those will heal. Though it does mean he's in a terrible mood. Right. So we're not getting a health penalty, um, mood penalty for having an unburied corpse. Although we have several rotting corpses in our kill chamber. But oh, who, who cares about that kind of detail? You just go sleep in Fisher's old room, covered in her clothes and corpses. Look at how much blood's in there. Bug blood of a mega spider and a mega scarab. There's slime and there's blood and rock rubble. <laughs> oh dear. Cargo pods. Human meat. Well, we're not running out of food, so I shan't be grabbing the human meat. Thank you very much. Ooh, scarab meat. Just looks like three turds. But, you know, a lot of food looks nasty to certain individuals. I mean, you shouldn't try it. How are we doing? Just cataracts and scars and horrible moods. Good, good. Ah, still really want to... We need to get these... Um... Either dumped or butchered. Someone's got to do that. Come on, guys. Wake up. We've got a full day ahead of us. You need treatment. That's just for your bruises, isn't it? Yeah. Um, Anna, I know you're a cook. Get butchering, please. I won't mind some mega spider meat. Oh my god. We're cleaning. Go on, Merritt. I believe in you. You can get all that blood out by the end of the day. Should we maybe cut down on the sewable area? I think we'll we'll cut down one field. So we've got plenty of food. You might say too much. And maybe since we've got 
hundreds of meat, I might make some lavish meals. Solar flare. Solar flare has begun. The intense radiation will shut down all electronic devices. It should pass in about a day. Before I forget, we need a turret and a turret. So we have eight components now and it takes six to build two. And lots of steel down here, so hopefully that should be all we need. There's no more blood in our colony. Yay! Fantastic. Let's set for a brief period of time some fine meals. Oh, none of them are cooking six. That sucks. Cooking one, and cooking four. Anna, tell me you're a good cook. Cooking eight. Let's recruit Hannah. Come on. Join us. Join us. Yay! Anna! You are new cook. Right. Anna, fire fight. You're going to be patient one. Actually, you're going to be patient two and bed rest two. Flick one. And in fact, five will make you guys back up doctors. Just for the sake of it. Um... Wardening, 11 to 10. Give you the same situation. And then cooking two. And then the rest will make threes. Just so that you're not prioritizing it over your own health. And I think that'll do. Knock you off that kind of thing. Yeah, I think that'll do. Alright, I think that's going to do it for this episode. If you've enjoyed the content, be sure to leave a like. If you love the content, be sure to subscribe, leave a comment and all that jazz. If you're not quite sure, stay for the end card, see the rest of the content we've got to offer. We do have Total War coming up, so if you're interested in Total War Warhammer, maybe you should want to check that out. But anyway guys, I'm going to see you later. Toodaloo!